Adios be with you. And just a little speculation from me, but looking at their design, you should aim for their joints. Take them apart at their weakest points and you might have a chance. I see. Then let's pray our aim is true. I... I know I'm repeating myself at this point, but don't go doing anything crazy. You hear? Still, I know in my heart how much you want to protect this school. So do what you think you have to do. Not just for us, but so that whatever ends up happening, you'll know you gave the best you had to give. That's good. Seems the battle's already underway. There, toward the west exit. Let's move! Impossible! Are you even human? Oh, I'm as human as they come. Can't speak for the principal, though. Or Instructor Beatrix, for that matter. I'll say, our decorated veterans are putting the younger generation to shame. Now, now. There's no need to go around flattering old ladies, Nightheart. Ah, no need to be so modest, Beatrix. I don't know of any other old ladies who could reduce an armored car to a smoldering wreck that quickly. Says the man who cut one in half. <laughs> Always nice to share a little outing with my wonderful colleagues. And while we're at it, since when were the two of you such whizzes with all those high level arts? Especially you, Thomas. When did you leave the library long enough to become so disturbingly proficient with an orbital staff? <laughs> well, you know me. I've always been rather taken with the mages of the Middle Ages. Th they're monsters! Sir, we don't stand a chance against them! Ah, stop your whining! They did this? By themselves? I almost feel sorry for the soldiers. Um... Who is Instructor Beatrix? She was a colonel in the Imperial Army. They used to call her the Reviver. Heard she saved Sarah's life once even. Yeah, she's kind of a legend. In her days with the medical corps, she'd show up in war zones to treat the critically injured. She'd patch them all up, friend or foe. And woe to anyone or anything who tried to stop her. Wow, no wonder she's so unflappable. You know, maybe they don't need our help after all. No, it's not over yet. It looks like they've got some reinforcements coming in. Cease your fire! There's no need to increase our casualties any further. If they're fielding monsters, we might as well call in our own. Here they come. <laughs> They've certainly brought quite a few of those. They're boasting some impressive armor. Looks like they've been designed with integrated arts resistance, too. Hmm. What to do, what to do? You think we can really beat all these things? Well, I don't see another way out of this, do you? We need to hold this location until the Imperial Army's reinforcements arrive, no matter what. 
time to see if the Army's finest up-and-coming officer has it where it counts. Same to you, Miss A-Rank Racer. My, my! You two really do make quite the dynamic duo. Shut, Shut up, up, Thomas! Thomas. Alright, Palestine and Nightheart are taking court. Let's give them some cover. Yes, sir. Now, let's see which ones have that parts resistant shield. They certainly seem to be holding their own. Yeah, but look how many they're up against. And the enemy's still got strength to spare. If the instructors don't have anything to fall back on, the enemy gets the upper hand. Let's go. They need backup, and we're here to give it to them. Right. I'm not sure how much support we'll be able to provide them. At the very least, we should be able to keep one of those things busy. If we can give them that much more of a fighting chance, I'll do it. <laughs> that won't be necessary. What? Sharon? Allow me to handle things here. I'll be sure to give Lady Sarah and her colleagues the opening they need to clinch their victory. Huh? She's fast. I figured you'd show up sooner or later. Oh my! Steel wires. These new model engines certainly are quite the step up. I'm impressed. Still, all the power in the world doesn't mean much if you're all tied up. The pleasure of being bound, vulnerable, and exposed is a thrill like no other. Would you care for a little demonstration? I'd say you won't feel a thing, but that would be lying. So you finally dropped the act, huh? Looks like you've even picked up a few new tricks since our little dust-up two years ago. But I guess I wouldn't expect any less from Sharon Kruger, Ouroboros' enforcer number nine. Or should I just call you the Severing Chains? I'm currently on leave from that position. Right now I'm but a humble maid in the service of the Rhinefoot family. And no matter who's pulling the strings, anyone who tries to harm Lady Elisa or her friends will have to get through me first. That's fine by me. But I think you and I need to sit down and have a nice long talk after all this is over. I'll bring the snacks. Oh, look at them go! Are you just going to stand there and let the ladies run laps around you, Major? Of course not. I was just about to say we should focus our assault on one and hit it with everything we've got. Boys will be boys. Oh my! I feel like a mere mortal walking among titans. Okay, I think I got these guys figured out. Gonna nullify their arch capabilities. <laughs> you sure know how to show a guy a good time. You got some real fight in you. I can respect that. Still, there's only so much you can do against these soul dots. Let's see how long you can hold out, shall we? You're a military academy. Let's see how much fight you've really got in you. So, Elisa, just who the heck is Sharon? Don't ask me! I want to know just as much as the rest of you! I'm pretty sure my mother knows her background, but she never told me. Still, 
Now they may have at least a chance of victory. But not a great one by any stretch. Still, we've seen those suits demolish battle tanks in just a few hits. Every second we hesitate. You're right. If we join the fight, their chances would be that much better. That sound. It's faint, but I can hear it. No way. But, but that's coming from the opposite direction of the capital. Lammy! <laughs> We've got two of those armors coming in fast! A blue one and a green one! <laughs> well, they certainly don't seem to be holding back on our account. Are they trying to catch the town in a pincer attack? The instructors and Sharon have their work cut out for them with those five. Looks like we're the first and only line of defense, then. Yeah. Get ready, everyone! Trish does east exit in sight now. No hostiles visible. I hear they've rounded up quite the posse to defend this little town. But I'm sure they've got their hands full dealing with Vulcan. Never mind that, though. We're not here for the town. Seize instructions were to head straight for the academy, take all of the students captive. Roger that, Comrade S. <laughs> We've got a group of unknowns dead ahead. Hmm? My, my, what have we here? <laughs> and here I thought Vulcan would get all the fun to himself. But you didn't let me down, did you, Class 7? You managed to turn up every single time. Commencing operation. Our objective is to defend Trista's east exit. Aim for the one in the front and give it everything you've got. Yes. <laughs> How cute. You seriously think you can beat a Soldot's unit, do you? It just wouldn't be sporting of us to attack at the same time, so... Why don't you soften them up a little first? Roger that. With pleasure. You've interfered with our cause for far too long. It's time you got what's coming to you. Let's see how long you last against this dragon! Watch out, guys! My turn! Alright, let's do this! Yeah, Leave yeah. it to me! Oh, my God. There you go! Keep it up, everyone! Okay. Right! Shatter! Okay. Can you handle this? With pleasure. I'll show you how it's done. Arcus, activate! Here we go! Now's a chance! Here! Of course! Hey! We hold the might of the Arcade School! Yeah! 
chance! It's my turn. I'll handle this. I leave this to you. I'll handle this. My turn. There. Of course. Huh? It's my turn. Hang in there. Thanks. You have my face. My turn! Alright, let's do this! Leave it to me! Alright! Can you handle this? I'll show you how it's done. Thank you. 
very well. Now is our chance. Don't let it pass! Leave, leave it to me! Right! Hang in there! You have my face. Thank you. Here we go! Burn the edge! Another chance! Let's go, everyone! All right. Okay. Leave it to me! Right about aiming for the joints. <laughs> I should have expected that C's classmates wouldn't go down easy. <laughs> I recognize that grating voice. Scarlet? You're in there, aren't you? Oh, did you miss me? I'm sorry we didn't get a chance to play at mine. But I hope you haven't forgotten that I owe you for getting in my way at Gorelia Fortress. You managed to be one soul lines, but once is just luck. Let's see how you fare against a Spiegel. <sighs> that one's not like the others. It must be a command unit. So it has weapons the regular suits don't? Oh, believe me. You'll find out. Sadly, I doubt we'll survive the demonstration. But at least try to put up some token resistance. Very well, I will serve as your opponent. Here we go! Thank you. How about this? I'll handle this. Now is our chance. Don't let it pass. Run. Okay. Of course. Huh? Here we go. <laughs> it's my turn. Sorry, would you mind? I'll try at least. Keep it up, everyone! Here we go! Right! I'll handle this. My turn! No way! It reflected all our attacks. That's cheating! And this, children, is what we call reactive armor. Think of it as a protective field that the pilot can activate at will. They originally designed it to defend against tank assault, but as you can see, that's not its own use. The 5th Division really outdid itself this time. Reen? Hey, what are you... You're not. It's the same as when we fight the Viscount. No, don't! Don't do it, Reen! <laughs> So this must be that power of yours that C mentioned. I wonder if you 
wonder if it'll really give you the strength to take down this speaker. If I go full force, it'll probably cost me my life. But if that's what it takes to keep them all safe, then that's the price I'll pay. Lane, stop! You don't have to do this! Dost thou desire the power? What? If thee and I are of one accord, a covenant can be made. Thou hast but to call out my name. One in whom dwells the flame. Awaken her. This voice. It looks like all the conditions have finally been met. S Celine, you can talk? Yes, yes, quite eloquently too. But that's not important right now. Right now, you need to stay focused. You should know his name already. You saw it deep within the realm of the Great Shadow. Uh. She's right. I remember the name. It feels so familiar. Like I've always known. Heed my call. Balamar, the Ashen Knight! Life share. Well, whatever. It's not going to save their skins this time. Playtime's over, brats. Unless you have a death wish, I suggest you get the hell out of here. What was that? Is the provincial army bombarding the town? Wait! No! Shit! Is that what C was talking about? You. Is this one of the great knights from the ancient legends? So the tales are true. You see before you one of the divine knights, incarnations of the great power, the Ashen Knight, Valimar. Damn it! The 
This wasn't in the plans. It shouldn't have been able to move yet. Fundamental knowledge was granted to you. But you've got a more pressing issue to deal with right now. And this Divine Knight doesn't have a weapon yet either. You're mine! <laughs> it evaded that attack like a trained duelist. Like Greenwood. Figured out the basics. Green! Is he inside that thing making it move? <laughs> That's awesome! I recognize that stance. The eight leaves one blade styles unarmed for. <laughs> You're just full of surprises, aren't you? Huh. Looks like you might be able to handle this after all. The Eight Leaves One Blade School has a form we use if we're disarmed or have to fight without a weapon. And believe me, Master Ka Fai drilled it into me so thoroughly I could do it in my sleep. Sounds like you owe him a thank you next time you see him. Watch out! Here she comes! Let's see what we can do!
grind for it and finish my temper sword in time. I be the one still standing. This battle is over. There's no reason to keep fighting. Now get out of Trista and take the squad by the west exit with you. Reen. Yeah, beat it and don't come back. All right. This should be all the backup they need at the west exit and then some. Damn. Whoa, whoa, hold up just a sec. Aren't you forgetting something? <gasps> that voice. Something's coming. Blue Knight? Then Valimar wasn't the only Divine Knight that was awoken. See? Am I ever glad to see you? The Azure Knight? So he was an Awakener all along. <sighs> I'll bet she's the one who guided him to it, too. Crow. Crow! Are you really in there? Sure am. Long time no see, Reen. Oh well, not too long, I guess, seeing as we just had dinner together last night. But that all feels strangely distant now, you know? Another lifetime almost. Why? Why are you doing this? Are you really the one who shot the Chancellor? And where did you even get that thing? It's thanks to the Imperial Liberation Front's planning that I wound up at the Academy in the first place. It was a nice spot to bide my time while we waited for our chance to take out the Chancellor. Gotta say, though, the whole school thing was a lot more fun than I expected. Almost makes me sad to leave it behind. But at the end of the day, I'm C. That's the real deal. The crow armbreast you've known all this time, he isn't real. He never was. Like hell he isn't! All the good times we had? Your friendship with Toa and Angelica and George? Do you seriously want me to believe that all of that was just a lie? That our hanging out, our field studies, even our concert meant nothing to you? <sighs> I'm... Yeah, I'm afraid so. Oh no. Crow, why are you doing this? Reinford made that for the Soldots units. I know it's not the kind you're used to, but it's the best you're gonna get right now. So, what do you say we settle things once and for all? A double saber. Just like C used. Then there's no room left for doubt. Crow really is C. I take no joy in this, but we can't have that Ashen Knight of yours getting in the way later down the line. So I'm afraid I'm gonna have to bust it up, along with the Academy. As for you students and the staff, you'll be under our jurisdiction. So that's the plan if you win, huh? But well, what about if I win? <laughs> <laughs> if you win, I'll pay up the interest I owe you on that 50 Mira. Hell, we could even trade places. I'll babble on about friendship and dreams, and you can have fun for once in your life. You've got yourself a deal. But I hope you know what you just signed up for. Because the Bank of Reen has the highest interest rate on the continent. And if we'll be trading places, don't forget you'll have a mountain of work waiting for you back at the Academy. So one way or another, you'll be coming back with us, Crow! <laughs> you got some real stones. I'll give you that. But sure. I'll agree to those terms. Let me give you one final word of warning. 
If you're still thinking we're some sort of partners in crime or buddies or whatever, you should stop deluding yourself. Come at me like you want me dead. Showing mercy here will get you killed. Crow. This is bad. Their will to fight is causing an enormous outpouring of mana. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Ha! Now, here goes. That's it. Can't lose. 
Bruce! Halfway, do you? I thought I knew what you could do with your eight leaves training, but you're fighting on a whole nother level today. Good thing, too. Otherwise, I'd never have stood a chance against you. Time to make good on our wager, Crow. You're coming back with us. You've been piloting a Divine Knight for one day. I've been using mine for three years. Did you think I wouldn't have a trump card to play? <laughs> Damn it! It's like I didn't even face him. My head! When a Divine Knight is damaged, the Awakener shares their pain. Just as I feared, it was too early. Or perhaps it may have been too late. No! No, no you, you don't! don't. <gasps> Guys, what are you doing? We are going to buy you time to get away from here. Run, while you still have the chance. I can't. I won't just leave you all here. You can, and you must. Heimdall's been occupied, and it's only a matter of time before we've got a full-blown civil war in our hands. They might have been caught off guard today, but the Imperial Army's full of elite soldiers. When the war starts, it'll be long and bloody. But it doesn't have to be like that. You and the Ashen Knight could change things. You could find a third way, like Prince Oliver was talking about. A way that doesn't bow to either faction. You can become the wind that changes the course of this conflict. You 
guys, I... No, I can't! You'll never make it against him by yourselves! Just run, please! <laughs> Just look at yourself. You're in no position to be worrying about us. Yeah! Just leave it to us! Once you've escaped, we'll go join the instructors, so don't worry. Take care of him for us, okay, Celine? Easier said than done. Prolonging current battle poses a risk of sustaining irreparable damage. The immediate tactical retreat is advised. That voice! Are you... Valimar? So, you've gathered enough power, have you? Well, we may have lost this battle, but at least we'll live to fight another day. All right, get us out of here! As far away in Erebonia as you can take us! Command acknowledged. Charting course. Wait! No! That's my call to make! Let me stay! 